he said in court yesterday. He apologized for his actions and said he took full responsibility for the shooting. Yeah. All right. Now, earlier I put out a video where Tory Lane's lawyer was letting everybody know how he was feeling since he got sentenced to 10 years in prison for Megan Thee Stallion. But now we have an official statement from Tory Lane's and this comes directly, directly from his Instagram. All right. Now, Tory said to the umbrellas. I have never let a hard time intimidate me. I will never, never let no jail time eliminate me. Regardless of how they try to spin my words, I have always maintained my innocence and I always will. Remember, I told y'all Charlemagne the guy went on the breakfast club and said, Tori apologized for bang, bang, Megan Thee Stallion. But, he never really said that in his statement. He was talking about some of the other stuff that he did that night. He talked about revealing secrets, which was basically talking about his relationship with Kelsey and Megan. He wanted to apologize for that. That night, I said some immature things and let some secrets out. I revealed to them some secrets that I shouldn't have. And for that, I apologize, but I can't change that. And I guess maybe going back and forth with them. But he never said I was sorry for, you know, bang, bang, Megan Thee Stallion. OK. Now. This week in court, I took responsibility for all verbal and intimate moments that I share with the parties involved. That's it. OK, see that. It, well, I guess he just explained it. I didn't know he was going to say that. <laughs> I, I guess it's right in front of me. My bad, y'all. In no way, shape or form was I apologizing, uh, apologizing, apologizing for the charges I'm being wrongfully convicted of. I remain on the stance that I refuse to apologize for something that I did not do. I faced adversity my whole life and every time it looked like I would lose, I came out on top. This is nothing but another moment where my back is against the wall and I refuse to stop fighting till I come out victorious. Tough times don't last, tough people do. Okay. To my family, friends, and umbrellas, Thank you for your continued support. All right. See you soon. My bad. He says, see you soon. So going back to what I said about Charlemagne, the guy, I feel like this is a response that is directly to him and what he said. All right. I'm going to play that clip for y'all, too. For everybody who keeps saying uh, they don't believe Tory did this, like mm -hmm. as you just read, actually, according to NBC News, he said in court yesterday, he apologized for his actions and said he took full responsibility for the shooting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. One of his exact quotes was, if I could change it, like you just said, if I could change it, I would, but I can't. Everything I did that night, I take full responsibility. I'm just truly trying to be a better person, which I don't understand, because why would you wait until the day you are sentenced to come clean? Like everything his lawyers was trying to do, like saying that he had childhood trauma and an mm -hmm. alcohol problem, mm -hmm. that only works if you admit you did it. So if that was gonna be your defense, he should have came clean a, a whole lot earlier. You don't wait till the day of sentencing. Now, I just wanted to go back to exactly what Tory said. Now, first he said, that night I said some immature things and let some secrets out. I revealed to them some secrets that I shouldn't have, and for that I apologize, but I can't change that. I want to apologize for everything I took part in and even being in that situation. And for everything I did wrong, I take full responsibility and I'm mature enough to say I was wrong. So y'all tell me, do y'all feel like Tory was saying, I apologize for a bang bang? Or was he apologizing for, like he said, the secrets that he let out and some of the other immature things that he did that night in that car? Because, you know, they all were drunk and tore up. And I'm pretty sure they all did some things, okay? So let me know what y'all think. Make sure you like the video and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.